My name is Clarissa Augustinus. I work for UN Habitat in charge of the land and GLTN unit. The pillar process is all about making it work as a pro poor, making land readjustment work as a pro poor instrument. And two of the key criteria are facilitating and strengthening the interdependent relationships between the different stakeholders, including the community with the local authority, between the different forms of local authority in metropolitan areas, between the urban governance structures and rural governance structures. All this interdependence requires enormous amounts of coordination and negotiation. It can't just be undertaken as a technical exercise. Unless you uh, have the stakeholder integration and coordination aspects, you do not exit from your land readjustment with sufficient social capital for that community to continue and to be sustainable.